Apple just released their newest iOS update with iOS 17.1. With this latest update, they also added the name drop feature that allows you to easily share your contact information with other iPhone users just by holding your devices near each other. You've probably seen this all over social media too. There's been a lot of talk about security issues with this, but in order for it to work, the iPhones need to be almost touching each other and you need to choose to share your contact info with the other person. So it's not an instant and automatic thing like some people are saying it is. But if you don't want this feature on at all, and you don't think you'll be using it, you can also turn it off really easily. To do this, from your home screen, find and then open the Settings app. Next, scroll down a little bit and then find and choose General. Inside of the General Settings menu, find and tap AirDrop. At the top inside of here, you can then choose how open your AirDrop settings are. You can receive only, AirDrop only with contacts, or open it up to everyone for 10 minutes. But the setting that we're looking for right now in this video is bringing devices together. This is the new feature that allows name drop. To turn this feature off, just tap the slider on the right to disable it. Once you do that, name drop and contact sharing will then be turned off. And when you hold your iPhone to someone else's, you won't even see the option appear. If in the future you do want to turn this back on, you can just head back into the settings here and then tap on the slider again to re-enable it. This can actually be a pretty useful feature to use. If you're in a conference or around people you want to network with, for instance, by turning this on and using name drop, it makes it way easier to exchange contact info with others. But if you don't want to have it on always, maybe just turn it on when you're in those situations. And that's how you turn off the new iOS 17 name drop feature on your iPhone.